Minori, you can make all your wishes come true. Shiro, I... I'm in love with you. Yo, what up is your boy Red? I'm sorry for that spoiler, but that's been spoiled for at least a year now, right? This show's been out for a while. Um, I'm, I love this show, right? Log Horizon, god damn, man, it's been a while. I own Log Horizon 1 and 2 on DVD set. That came out, what? 2015 was the last episode of season two so it's been at least six years since you know i've been waiting for a season three and uh there's only the first what 12 episodes hopefully there's a second part to this we don't know yet i don't know yet but uh what is log horizon for you those who have not seen it's an isekai kids get stuck in a video game unlike other isekais and they get stuck in the video game these guys focus on the video game part as well as politics this season around uh hence it's called the destruction of the round table uh, so their government is falling apart uh, people still struggling with this world you know i mean it's hard to go from real life to a video game world where you you know your whole thing is based on leveling and stuff like that actually that gets really a real you know hot, hot topic in this season as well as we find out what happens to Krusty uh when he disappeared i think it was season two or season one i mean it's been a while and we get to see more relationships grow like the clip i posted which is something i've been waiting for for a while but uh, this character she's my one of my favorites so um we also get some raid not too much action this first part of the season if it's only first part uh, but we get a lot of politics speaking we get a whole voting democratic you know thing going on we got we get a cool raid at the end of the se uh of the of the uh whole 12 episodes we get a cool one we get uh i think we get even a, a besides you know the the clip i posted of uh, someone speaking spilling out their you know feelings we get some confirmation as well well hopefully i don't know we i'll get to talking about that a little bit in a little bit right but like i said this is a good actually 12 episodes i love this show they changed the opening by the way that was interesting to me they haven't changed the opening since season two so that's cool so the music is pretty cool, action is cool, dialogue, everything is cool about this show if you don't like it. I mean, it's a little different from other isekais, but I love it, right? By the way, that scene I posted where Midori finally confesses to Shiro, I love it. I cried, I swear to God, especially what happens afterwards. Um, but it is stated that Shiro has feelings for someone else, spoiler alert. So he has to decline her feelings, which is really sad. And it kind of shows Akatsuki in the background when he's doing this. So. I don't know if he's in love with Akatsuki or is he's thinking about his old flame. Um, I forget her name. You know, that girl that he used to play with and she's in the other server right now. So it, I don't know where this is going, but hopefully we get more clarification later on. I know you guys don't really care about the romance. I do. And especially in these kind of situations where our heroes kind of like an anti-villain. So it's kind of cool. And we get to see other people, the princess. Uh, I think she's in love with Krusty. I'm not sure. You know, stuff like that go on. But all this is, you know, side story compared to our main story that the, uh, I think they're called the Geeks or the, I forget the name of it, but those dudes are attacking them, uh, different monsters, different levels we've seen throughout, you know, the second season and now third season. It, this stuff is going down. They figure out they have to go to the moon to figure out what's going on. By the way, people are disappearing in the show. They actually go over in like the episode one or two. Uh, Shiro talks about people disappearing. We get to see one of the uh, background characters that we've been seeing through season one and two not there anymore. She's gone and her companions, they're looking at her poster. So it's something's going on. People are speculating maybe they went back to Earth. Who knows? I mean, Krusty disappeared, but he's the only one we had a contact with ever since. So who knows what's going on? And hopefully we get to see more of that soon. And uh, let me tell you guys, it's a good, good show. If you haven't seen season one or two, watch it. Then watch this one it's just as good as those last two if not better actually my score for season three i'm gonna give it a nine out of ten so far if this is part one this is a great starter to it if this is just the whole season it's a great season nine out of ten is a good score right um don't forget i'm selling you merchandise down below hit those links and thanks again for watching this review of long horizon season three peace